Hey everyone, Red here, and welcome back to another Red's Requested. And today we have the Scaring Friends Wraith build. So let me go ahead and break it down real quick. First, we have a Scourge Hook Pain Resonance. The first time a survivor is hooked on a Scourge Hook, the gem with the most progress is going to detonate for 25%. Second, we're running a Dead Man Switch. Whenever we hook a survivor, this perk will activate for 30 seconds, and if any survivor stops repairing a generator until it is finished, the entity will then block the gen for the remainder of the 30 seconds. Third, we have a Lethal Pursuer. This will allow us to see the aura of all survivors at the start of the trial, and anytime a survivor's aura is shown for a period of time, its duration will be increased by 2 seconds. And last but not least, we have Friends Till the End. When we hook a survivor that is not the Obsession, the Obsession will become exposed for 20 seconds and reveal their aura for 10 seconds. But whenever we hook the obsession, another random survivor will scream, reveal their position, and become the new obsession. As far as add-ons, we have Windstorm Blood, which will increase the race movement speed while cloaked by 9%. And we have Coxcomb Clapper, which renders our Wailing Bell completely silent. Overall, this looks like a really fun build and should allow us to hopefully hunt down some obsessions. If you have a build you want to see on the channel, make sure to leave it down in the comment section below. If it looks like fun, you might just see it here. Much love. Now let's go ahead and get to the gameplay. All right, in game number one, we have on Toba Landing. Let's go. Well, it should be a decent map for us to catch survivors off guard, though it is always a map that is hard to look at. One survivor going up and around. We already have someone working on a gen right here, though, so let's see if maybe I can get a quick little tag. Hello? Ooh, I was hoping I could get maybe a pull there, but maybe I just started the swing a little early. That's okay, though. Looks like... Yep, looks like it's going to be a very quick down. I see one survivor right here, but... Shouldn't be able to get that flashlight save. Nice. Yeah, we should be good. Oh, hey, look. There is a Dwight. You know, you are just the person I'm looking for. Come here. Oh, wow. That is a very bright flashlight. And Champion of Light is definitely going to stop me. Probably from getting friends value here, but we'll see what we can do. Friends doesn't last really, really long, so... Maybe. Uh, I think I can still catch him here. We'll see. Oh, maybe not. He maybe falls for a fake. Nice little greed. I'll take it. This is my hit now. See if we can use Windstorm. Maybe cut him off. Looks like he's aiming for Shaq. Oh, yeah. I'm going to deny this. Thank you. We'll take it. All right, and we have a pain res right nearby, so let's go ahead and throw him on that real quick. There we go. Where is it at? Over there. Fair enough. That is Dead Man's. We also had Dead Man's on main get knocked off. Oh, and a David falling from the sky. Hey, man. One pallet here. We got two pallets in this area. Oh, uh, I think this is okay. I could have gotten in front of him a little bit, but... Oh, well. I guess it wouldn't have mattered. He would have been able to get to a pallet, I think, anyway there. Oh, one extra person here. Hi. Can you give me a free pallet? Thank you. And another champion of light. You'll love to see it. I love being slowed for years. And blinded. Where are you at? I can hear you. Ooh. Pretty close here. Does have a little wall. And light. Let's see if she can get... Yeah, she has another pallet right here. You're going to drop this for me? All right, we are dropping them quick. I like it. I think I got a little bit of time. I'm going to see if I can burn through some of these pallets real quick. There you are. Always trying to listen exactly. Thank you. Oh, looks like she's not going to go for a flashlight anymore. There we go. That's quite a few resources down. Hey, man. Let me guess. You going to drop this one? Thank you. It's not necessarily the worst thing to pre-drop them because it can waste a lot of time no matter what. But we can always try and just burn them now. That way we don't have to worry hopefully about like mid-game. But it does hurt us in this like little early game section. Because while they're burning these pallets, they are still working on generators. Unfortunately, I lost the chase there. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to give this one up. Oh, they're right there on that gen. Fair enough. He dropped that pallet. Hey, Dwight, what's going on, man? We'll take that. He's busy. This gen's almost done. Where are we at? Oh, I knew we were right here, but I kind of lost it. Perks of Toba. 
Don't hear anyone in the locker breathing. Dwight might have moved over this way. Oh, here we go. Nice flashbang. Maybe? Nope, but another pallet down. Here soon enough, they'll be out of the pallets, but I'm sure they still have a few to play with. Nope, we didn't come back. Get that regressing just a little bit, and we'll break this now. We're not working up here, fair enough, so we'll go right back out here. And there's the Dwight. Oh, but he's got the vault here. Yeah, but it's just to come out of cloak. Ah! Nice. No fast vault, so we get a free hit. Let's go ahead and throw him up on the hook. No! Where are we at? Oh, she's right there. Wow. Not a gen I thought was going to go, but we had some time. Hey, man. Another gen. Wow, we're actually closer to two gens right now. Ah! Hold that for me. I need someone else on a uh, death hook here. It would have been nice to have another pain res, but oh well. Not really much we can do. She's now our obsession. Hi. Can I get you off that? Thank you. Unfortunately, I think she broke it, so. Another life. I don't want to get play around this. Do we have any pressure over here is the question. A little bit up there, not much. No one's here at the moment. So we have somebody going to be going back for a save here in a second. Yeah. All right, let's just hop over this. I'm going to head back that way and see if we can see anybody. Not to mention they might come to this gen. Oh, yeah, they're right here. I could use an extra pain res, my guy. He's going to have a few things to play with, but maybe we can get in front of him. I mean, we burned a lot of pallets except for, like, one over here. Oh, let's just do this. There we go. I don't know, though, if I have any pain res around here for me to utilize. Ooh, it's a distance. They're probably going to get that gen done, unfortunately, which will put us at two. Yep, there it goes. Hopefully that Bane Res at least nuked a gen for its full 25%. Yeah, she's going to hold forward. This is normally the best thing you can do. Oh, wait. Maybe hiding. Hello? Hmm. I'll be close. I feel like Swift Hunt would be so much nicer to have for moments like this. Ah, just at the very end. I wanted to come out of stealth just a little bit earlier there because I wasn't sure if we had any resources, but here we are. Should we be able to get this hit, right? Ooh, so close. All right, I got to get back over here. I need to take someone out of the game, and she is definitely not someone who's out of the game. But whoever came for the save, yeah, definitely is. Hi. Hold that for me. So you're just going to go to the main window here, I'm guessing? Maybe? Oh, really? I felt like we definitely had that one, but I guess not. He'll drop this. Yeah. I feel like we have to kind of put him down now. Otherwise, we'll just get killed on the gens. I don't think he has anything else really to play with. Maybe a pallet coming up. Yeah, right there. Thankfully, over here, there isn't too much more for them to work with. And we are down to our last gen. No 3-gen in sight, unfortunately. And we have her kind of moving away. I don't know if I can really get any friends value. But I'm going to try. No, I think I have to check the gens first. The gens are a little bit more important to kind of push people off. So we are in this corner gen. Ooh, they could have a lot of progress on it. We also have uh, David not looking to like, get healed or anything like that. Oh, here we go. Oh, you know, I was really thinking that he had life as well. But no, the dead heart makes sense. That's a mistake on my end that could hurt us quite a bit, but at least it's still a quick down. Because we burned through all the pallets a while ago in this area. Still, though, it is looking to be like an insanely close game. Where are we at? Oh, there we are. I might actually be able to get some friends value here. 
Oh yeah, there's nothing really she has to work on here. Or work with. We'll take it. Now what I really need is a pain res, but I don't think there's any around here, right? It's the one that he just got hold, held off of? Yeah. Well, that's unfortunate. So let's go ahead and drop her here. I'm going to do this just so we can get Dead Man Switch time. There it is. And then we can hook her up. I do want to give this a little bit of a base kit because we're right there. So keep that going down. And then see if we can find... Hey, man, what's going on? The vault. I don't know if I really want to hold forward on Dwight here. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm really looking for the survivor to come back kind of over to uh, the save. All right, we're not working on the gen. I don't want to get pulled into like a semi-long chase or like stuck at like these vaults here. I might be able to get him here. We'll see. Get in front a little bit. Ah, I can't. Fair enough. Gotcha. Champion of Light. Gonna slow me down just a little bit. Lots of Champion of Light gamers. There he is. Cool. Honestly, going for her is not the worst call. Because this way we can get pain res. Oh, but she has this pallet coming up. A little more on the unfortunate side. Fair enough. Here, hold that for me. I'm pretty sure I can put this away. We'll see. I'm about to do it fair relatively quickly. Ooh, you know, I I swore that we'd already gotten rid of this pallet, but that's not good. All right, we got to get over here real quick. Kind of like right now. Are we not at this gen? Oh, we are not. So we're at main. There could be two survivors working on that gen. It could pop. Like the gen had a little bit of progress before. Oh, it's got a lot. They're going to try and pop it. Oh, come on, get out of the cloak. Ooh, that's a bummer. All right, there's one. Um, She's got to probably go for the door. But where's he going for? All right, he's kind of heading over to the same area. I hope she went for this door. She did. Awesome. Hi. No dead hard. Cool. All right, we got to get her hooked up right away. David's probably going to go for the save on him. He did. Okay, we can at least put the Dwight into a weird spot. Because Dwight's going to choose to go for the door, or he's going to go for the save. How are we doing this, buddy? Okay. Did I somehow block him from able to do that? Who knows? Now we just have to find the Dwight. Is Dwight brave enough to go for the save or? No, so maybe he did go for the door. Oh, here he is. Well, we should be able to wrap this up then as long as we have him kind of like right here. That's fine. Hi. Oh, and there goes David. So Unbreakable is out. Hunting David down. Let's hope Dwight does not have Unbreakable as well. I'm pretty sure we can get in front here. No, sir. Hi. How are you? Okay. And we are good. We brought it back just at the last second there. And that is game number one. Let's go ahead and go to our next. All right. And we have Father Campbell's for the second game. Shouldn't be too bad. It's a little bit smaller than Toba. And we have all survivors kind of starting in the same area, at least generally, which is a lot better than them starting, like, spread out. One on the gen, probably one on the back gen over there, unless they moved away from the gen, which would be weird. Maybe I can hide behind this? No, they started moving, didn't they? Yeah, that works out. I don't know if I can play on it. She'll just go straight to the vault. I'm okay with you. I want to see who's over here real quick. Hi. I'll take it. I see you got a toolbox in your hand. Put her off a little bit over here. All right, she's going to go for the vault. We'll take it. It is the obsession, so we lose a little bit of the possible friends value. At least we can still get somebody to scream. And we have a pain res. Oh, hello. 
right there. So we should be able to get some slowdown here. There we go. And Dead Man Switch. Plus, we have you here. Is this the Ada? Is that who screamed? No, it's you. Hello, Nia. Hold that for me. Thanks for the pallet. I'll take it for later. Nia looks like she also has a toolbox. We're right up there healing. Fair enough. Hey, Ada. Can I get you to drop this? Ooh. I thought she would definitely go back into the pallet. Well, I'm at least going to get the pallet, right? Yes. Cool. Alright, let's get it out of the way. It's a jungle gym pallet. I don't want to mess with it too much. Ooh. Ah, uh, sure. You sprint burst away. We'll take it. Try and burn through some of these pallets so I don't got to worry about them for later. Yeah, nice try. See if I can get in front of the vault here. Or at least make her choose. Uh, I don't think I can. Ah, that sucks. Well, let's see what we can do. Oh, here we go. Much better. Hold on. No. There it is. And now we have her stuck in, yep. The 50-50. Which actually is a little bit lean swords killer, so. One survivor in main, fair enough. And we have another pain res coming up. There we go. Where is the Nia? All the way over there. And she's actually crouching and hiding, so. Well, she's already got a lot of distance. The problem is I won't get anything out of it. Whereas here, I at least get to make a swap and get a little bit more value on pain res. Already gone, fair enough. Hopefully Nia's a little bit closer. Yeah, a little bit. Unfortunately, it's not like she's like fully healed. Hi, what's going on, gamer? There goes that sprint burst. I mean, overall, it looks goofy at what she's doing. But friends till the end only lasts her so long. So she kind of knows that I'm on my way. And it allows her to kind of set up a nice... Oh, I feel like that should have been a hit. But it allows for her to set up decent ways to get a lot of distance from me. Especially with sprint burst. Let's see if we can go for round two here, Ada. Yeah, you messed up. Okay, is that a styptic or a heal? I feel like that was really odd, Ada. I feel like that was incredibly odd, Ada. Well, I mean, it works for me, though. Back on our favorite hook of the map. Oh, right here. You are just trying so hard to hide from me. There it goes. Hi. I mean, it was a try. She does have a toolbox, so. But a very interesting gamer nonetheless. I don't get pain res, but I get to swap my friends to the end. Of course, it goes straight to the Ada. Balance landing? Yep. Well, that's unfortunate. I was hopeful I could catch it, but I guess not. Uh, we'll try and get in front. There we go. Should give us at least a little bit of a hit. But she's going to be able to play on Shaq now, which is unfortunate. Do you think I can just get her with, like, the standstill mind game? Like, just let, let her kind of come to us? I mean, she's kind of guessing in there, right? Huh. Maybe she saw me stand still. Who knows? Let's see if we can catch her off guard. Ooh. You know, if she was at the vault, maybe. But she did the smart thing. She sat at the uh, pallet. There it is. Hi. Where are you at? Right over there. Well... The problem is I don't know if we'll get it. She's only got to get to the vault, right? Yeah, and she's gone. Uh, maybe. We're right there. Ah, she did go for it, darn. Yeah. A little bit of a bummer. Oh, might as well uh, hold this for me. 
I could try and force her down real quick. But, I have one goober right over here who's got a lot more pressure on the gen. We have like three gens right now that seem like they're about ready to pop. Hi. Yeah, I can't allow it. Sorry. Right at the ball. Are we going to go for it? No. Up that way. Hi. I'm a little confused. Did you have balanced landing and just like not go for it? You are a very interesting survivor. On the bright side, I get a pain res. So that's pretty cool. And I have one Ada here. Maybe we get a snag? Oh, she's got a pallet. No, we don't get anything here. Yeah. Yep, there's just one of the things that'll happen. Thank you. I'll at least take the pallet. No real value outside of that. Always unfortunate when we can't really get the uh, friend's value, but later on, hopefully, we get like an extra chance. Who knows? Who we got here? Just you. Fair enough. I'm pretty sure you've only been hooked once. Which isn't the best thing. I kind of need to take a survivor out of the game here soon. I know it doesn't seem like it, but the four gens, like, people put too much uh, importance on that number four there. We have a lot of gen pressure out on the map right now. It wouldn't surprise me if we saw, like, one, two kind of pop off. There we go. Yeah, we're going to lose that gen. Yep, there it goes. All right. This will be one survivor out of the game. You don't want to take a hit. Fair enough. But you know what you will be is now really close for friends till the end. Nice. You didn't go for it. And now we get ourselves a quick down. There we go. And there it is. See? Like I said, it's one of those things where like a lot of people will put like an emphasis on like, why are you doing this at so many gens? But look at this right here. We're at almost zero gens right now. Ooh, we got one right over there. We'll kick this to get it regressing, and then I need to keep my eye on it for later. Here we are. Hi. Ooh, went on this side. Maybe I can get this? Yeah. Hey, what's going on? Thank you for not having dead hard. There we go, and then there was one. Let's see if she can find the hatch. Oh, and there she goes. She gets the hatch this time. But that is today's build. Overall, I hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Much love, everyone. And until next time, I'm Red, and I'm signing off.